whatever. Okay, so I'm going to introduce you to two exercises. One is a cable curl um, standing, and another one's called a lion cable curl, which is very unique. A lot of people ask me about this when they see me doing it in the gym. First thing I'm going to show you is a cable curl. Keep in mind, I have a straight bar down here that's hooked up to two different cables. I like this because it isolates each arm a little bit better, but you could use a short straight bar and just put it on one of the cables and do the same exact movement that I'm about ready to show you. So, again, we want to take about a shoulder width grip, stand straight up, keep our elbows to our side. That elbows, the elbows are the point of rotation. We're going to exhale up. We don't want to come all the way up because if we do, those elbows drift and we start using the deltoids. And back down nice and slow with an inhale and exhale up and back down again and repeat. That is a standing cable grip. Now you can also take a couple different angles with this. I can stand this way and get a little bit of different angle on the cable. And then now I'm going to show you a lying cable curl. Now keep in mind, you can still do a lying cable curl with just a single little bar that hooks to one cable. Again, I'm a fan of the bar that hooks to both cables. So a lying cable curl is simply lying on the floor and putting your feet up, keeping the elbows on the ground so that you don't, again, you don't lift your elbows up and use the deltoids, head back, and you're just gonna bring it forward like this. This is all bicep isolation. Inhale down and exhale up. Inhale down and exhale up, and then just repeat that process. And that is an introduction to the standing and the lying cable curl.